I'm Josh Ellsworth with Stalls TV and in this tutorial we're going to teach you all about working with text in CADWorks. First when you open up the CADWorks Design Studio application you'll have the option to add text from the left hand navigation. It's really simple. All you need to do is start with the blank screen and click on add text. And a text editor will populate where you can customize the text to whatever you want it to say. It will render a live preview as you're customizing it and you'll also be able to select from a variety of fonts that are already populated into CADWorks by clicking in the font selection. The fonts are categorized by folders depending on whether you want an athletic font, a basic font, uh, your favorites, fun fonts, etc. All of the popular stalls fonts are included already within CADWorks for your convenience and there's multiple pages of fonts that you can scroll through to make your selection. In this case we'll select Stalls Varsity. Note before we finalize our selection you can also upload your own font by clicking the upload font button. This will, op this will upload from your local device and you can save it for later use within CADWorks. I'll click on open with Stalls Varsity font selected. At this point I can size the character height to whatever I'd like if I want it to be 3 inch text. I can change the visualization of the fill color if I'd like with the click of a button from whatever color palette I would like within CADWorks. The line has to do with the vector cut line around the image. In most cases uh, for vinyl cut work uh, you'll want a transparent line unless you're designing with white text on a white uh, design backing then you may want to pick a uh, color line so you can see that there's white text there or you can simply click line equals fill and it will update to be green as well uh, that the fill color I have selected. In addition you can adjust character spacing if you'd like to see the um, text further spaced apart uh, in between individual characters. You can also alter the text direction as well uh, with the click of a button. From there I have my basic text created and you can see the film strip within CADWorks which is a a lot of the power within CADWorks is in this particular strip where you can add and remove effects. Uh, we call it the effects stack. Click the add effect button and I can select from a variety of effects already within CADWorks to apply to my text. So if I want to do something like a basic envelope on the text I select what I'd like, click on open and it will begin to add the effects. Note that when I have the text uh, selected down in the film strip it will give me all the properties of my text for editing when I have the envelope selected it will give me the properties of that particular envelope and I can continue to add effects and remove effects um, as I see fit for the particular design adding an arch in this case um, if ever you want to remove an effect you just select it and click on remove effect once you're happy with the result click OK cancel out of your font menu your text will drop onto your design screen and you're ready to add additional elements to the text or send it to cut. This has been a CADWorks Live tutorial by Stalls TV. Thanks for watching.